Hello, my lovelies. Welcome or welcome back to the channel. I'm Kamaria and we are doing Junk Journal July days five and six, which I think were wildlife and lettering. And listen, I, I'm not good at lettering, like hand lettering. Um, so I found like stickers that had lettering. I found, I found um, cardstock that had lettering on it. I found a vintage greeting card that had lettering on it that like cursive really nice. So, and then, um, one side of this page actually had like the paper had like, um, lettering on it. You can't really see it right now but there's lettering there so i have lots of lettering and then i have a book page in there and that's technically lettering so yeah so that's what we're gonna do here i tried to stick with like a yellow or golden uh color palette and let me tell you guys i love the way this turned out um so i'm just adding lots of yellows and gold i had a piece of ribbon that i put on that side um i found so the wildlife that i chose i found like a magazine that had some fish on it i looked through all my nat geos and i found bees and flowers and birds the birds and the bees yes <laughs> oh sorry um i had this golden washi tape so i'm i'm definitely staying within that uh vibe so a lot of times when i combine prompts it doesn't work out see my previous video even though it turned out fine and it was fine okay. but it's not going to be one of my favorites of all time as we go through the month oh i also found um wild the word wild in a magazine and I thought that that was kind of good wild wildlife so I thought that fit and it's technically lettering as well so we cover all our bases here <laughs> um one of the papers I put on the other side has butterflies on it just to kind of tie in wildlife um I wanted to just do bugs but I don't know if bugs are technically wildlife I mean I guess they are but like I guess when a lot of people think wildlife they think um mammals so I ended up actually finding some birds, yellow birds too. So I think that um, worked out pretty well. I was actually very, very lucky with some of the pictures that I, that I got. And then I also had to share with my daughter because she was right next to me. So she got a lot of birds too. <laughs> um, but if you haven't watched i've said it before but i am trying to pare down some of my magazines and or just use them again because i had a lot of stationery so i was using it and ignoring my magazines and now i need to go back to using magazines because i'm running out of supplies and um i don't have any uh plans to buy any more stationery for now <laughs> um adulting adulting sucks life be life in um but yeah, so I am adding a lot of these little birds, these little bees. I'm going to add uh, this piece of cardstock that came in a, like a paper pack about like Jane Austen. And it actually has like a fountain pen like in it and all this like beautiful uh, letter, old fashioned looking lettering. And I was just, oh, look at that stunning picture of that bird in flight. Like, I love it. Oh, I love it. But no, this just felt very vibrant, very um, positive and happy. And I needed positive and happy in my life. This, it's been a rough summer so far. Um, my husband is getting better, um, but he definitely has his good days and his bad days. Um, still, we're, you know, we're still a month away from him being able to go back to work. And some days he's great. And other days, you know, he's either, you know, he, you know, we're not. It could have been a lot worse, but the, definitely the road to recovery is long. <laughs> um, so I definitely needed some positivity. So um, I'm glad that I found that. Um, so this is what I was talking about. This little saying. May you be simply deluged with happiness today. Deluged? Deluged? 
Um, but it's from my mom's stash of being, um, um, her vintage stash of like greeting cards she had from back in the day. So that kind of covers more lettering that's like cursive and pretty. Um, Cause I, I've tried to do like hand lettering and like make it pretty, but I fail every time. I just don't have the patience for it. Um, my dad had beautiful penmanship, but um, my mom does not. And I do not. It's just kind of a means, a means to an end. Um, sometimes I can't even read my own handwriting, which is <laughs> sad. My cursive is actually getting better. The more I draw and the more I journal, my handwriting is getting better. Um, so I guess I could like do hand lettering and calligraphy if I tried, but ain't nobody got time for that. I got kids. I got a third kid right now, aka my husband. <laughs> so ain't nobody got time for that. Maybe one day when they're all gone. <laughs> I mean, when the kids are in school and my husband's at work or I have more free time. Um, but I'm a stay at home mom, so it never stops. It never stops. Free time. What's that? Um, but anyway, um, I'm adding just some of this like gingham. That's kind of in the mustardy mustard family. So it kind of matches, right? Yeah, let's go with that. Um, but. I think I have an extra butterfly that I'm going to prop in there just so I have a butterfly, another butterfly component to match because I have butterflies on one side, but not on the other. So I think I'm going to just cut out this little butterfly really fast. And then I'm going to add some just to not waste this piece of paper. I think I'm going to add some of those lines just as a little bit more decorative uh, flair since I had a, a, a few empty spaces because, hey, when in doubt, just tear it, man. Tearing just somehow makes something look more rustic and majestic. I don't know. <laughs> um, but I definitely like this combo, day five and six, the, a lot. This is definitely so far a contender for being my favorite so far. This is definitely going to be in the list. And it's weird because I usually don't gravitate towards bright color, like yellow or orange, especially or not in my wheelhouse. But this one came together so ridiculously well and nicely with intention. <laughs> um, so I really, really like this one. Um, I was just gluing some of that st extra stuff down because for some reason, um, a lot of my washi tape, you can't put stickers on it like they won't stick. I, I think that is finally the end and I'll see you in the next one guys. Bye.